Hello, today I'm going to show you the GP&J Baker Signature Wallpaper Book 2. This is a book of archival prints from the GP&J Baker archives and it's got an eclectic mix of varying different papers which I think you'll find there'll be something for everybody. The first one, Ramayana, is a lovely scenic wallpaper of a Persian country park. It's got a lake, it's got mag uh, beg your pardon, lotus flowers and trees heavy with fruit. It's got gentlemen hunting with their hawks and their dogs and it's got ladies dancing. First we have the teal, uh, which is a lovely dark uh, paper and I think you'll find that that uh, would look very smart in a dining room or maybe in your hall or somewhere. Here, I think, is the nicer one, which is wood smoke, which has uh, lovely highlights of the brown, sort of russety browns in it. And you can see, just pick out a little bit more of the birds and the, and the movement around the paper. So a slightly gentler paper, so that would sit well, uh, again, hall, dining room, uh, study, look very smart in a study. Here we have the blues, so similar to the teals, but they're all blues. Um, again, here you can see the fruit in the trees and it's fantastic. And this is multi, so this has the earth colours and then you've got the, the dress, the ladies in their dresses and their green dresses and uh, lovely again highlights of the oranges, burnt oranges. Uh, and more scenic, I think almost twirl like here, so you really, really get the feeling of, of the movement of the paper and the design. Moving on we have Shifu. This is quite a favourite of mine. This one was taken um, from a Qing Dynasty dragon robe and it, here it's shown in these beautiful jewel colours. They call it charcoal multi but these are just really, really lovely and uh, you've got lots, lots of lovely detail and the tails of the dragons and it's a very dramatic and fun eclectic wallpaper. It's shown here in blush so blush and grey very much in at the moment, trending. And I think that you could make that into a really very beautiful room. We have a classic blue and white and a classic green and white. And then my favourite, which is an ochre and blue. So I'm loving this sort of yellowy ochre background with the lovely vibrant blues. Stunning dining room. Uh, I think you put some lovely beautiful silk curtains with that and it would just be ugh, to die for. Langdale trellis. A classic trellis, very simply done, very very useful. It comes in six colours so we've got some neutrals, aqua, a blue, a lovely emerald green and then here you've got the teal with the gold highlights. I believe there's also a charcoal with the gold highlights as well. Magnolia. So this is a classic William Turner paper for GP and J Baker. They had uh, they have this as a fabric, and now they've produced it as a paper. I think this is just beautiful, vibrant, lovely, lovely colours. Um, it's a big design, so you need to be bold, but it really is stunning, and you could make a beautiful boot room out of that. Here we have it in the classic colours, so the oranges and the pinks with a bit of blues. So it's, it's really, again, eclectic. It's got a mix of everything there. And you could even put the fabric with it as well as the highlights in the room. And my favorite colorway, which is called Spice. It's a charcoal base. It's got these lovely burnt oranges and beiges with this lovely sort of sienna, sandy colored um, branches and the O'Donnell on the flowers. Really, really beautiful. I'm going to do a room around this. It's just too lovely. Really lovely paper. Icat Bukhara, very popular at the moment. There's a lot of Icats around, uh, especially in fabric, not so much in wallpaper. So well done, Bakers, for picking it up as a wallpaper. So here we have it in the emerald, the blush, sand, rather nice with the blue grey um, with it. Indigo, quite strong, teal, and then lastly, espresso. Smart study. Or well, boys' room, actually, and really nice. You could use these in a, a, a children's room or den, um, TV room. Emperor's Garden, another classic baker's fabric, 
and has been a wallpaper before too. So now we have some new colours. So this is quite strong, I have to say, for a blue. And um, you'd have to be quite clever how you work that, but it'd be lovely with, you know, just picking up the creams. Um, it could be a very smart bedroom. This one's very pretty, very lovely in the pink and the green. And that, again, a lovely bedroom. It's so pretty with its little birds and the lovely blossom. Nice soft green, unusual green, but really, really lovely. I'm quite a fan of green and I think that's a really pretty one. And then you've got a teal with a darker red, um, which is quite strong. Herringbone, another very good study type wallpaper, very versatile, lovely under the dado. Uh, I think you can use this all over. So we've got this in five colours, charcoal with a bronze, um, I think this is a linen, yeah, and that's got highlights in silvers. Then you've got an aqua stone, I'd imagine, yeah, and then you've got the sort of turquoise, tealy turquoise again with the gold highlights. Hydrangea bird, large design, another classic by William Turner. This lovely tree of life coming up here with these beautiful birds on it. It's a big design, it comes in two colours. So here we have the charcoal and sienna absolutely lovely um, you need a big room for for these and then you've got the blue and emerald which I think is just again love love the colors um, and great fun and you could really have a big wow factor with that ferns a classic baker's wallpaper we produced it before we've seen it produced before um, and now they've just got a few more colors to add to it so you've got the blush with the green You've got a softer leaf green, this rather nice dove grey metallic, so this has got a silver highlights on it. You've got the original green. Here we have the teal, which is rather striking. And then we have a charcoal and bronze, which I think has highlights or maybe not. No, not quite. And then actually, I think this one is really, really pretty. So it's a coral, they're calling this coral and charcoal, and it's got some aqua in it too. Very nice paper. These ferns, you know, they, they suit all sorts, um, from kitchens, conservatories, sitting rooms, they uh, look lovely anywhere. And lastly, heron and lotus flower, my least favorite, I have to say, um, although it is one of Baker's most favorite prints. Uh, again by William Turner. It's a bit blocky for me. It's very, um, it's very, it's not as, it hasn't got as much movement as the others, I feel, but um, I'm sure it will suit many homes. So there's a black and white, there's the stone, aqua, eucalyptus, which has highlights in it too. And then lastly, quite a strong, teal and blue. So there we have it, there are all the papers. I'll show the pictures here so you can see them again. Uh, my favourites, hmm, Chifu, actually I love the classic ones with the birds, Chifu Hodranger bird and the magnolia is lovely, but the Ramayana I think is a very nice paper too. So something for everybody. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you.